Hi guys, and welcome to a question and answer. Uh, this is the first one on this channel that I have done. Um, I just wanted to do it to see what um, sort of would happen, what sort of reaction I get from it. Um, this is just a question and answer I've done on Facebook, um, and so you know I'll, I'll put it out there for all you guys to leave comments and ask questions. So uh, the first question. Um, is from a friend of mine, Melissa, and uh, she asks, "When did I get um, when did I get into cosplaying and why?" Um, now, if you look at the video there, um, you'll see that's the reason why I cosplay. Um, but for those who don't want to sit there and watch the video, um, I used to get bullied at school, um, and cosplay was my way out of it. Um, and yeah, um, David Tennant, when he came on screen, he was someone who I connected with, someone I sort of could get away with, um, you know, in that sort of world of Doctor Who, and yeah, that's basically been my life, really, um, of, you know, doing cosplaying and things like that. Um, my very first TARDIS console uh, that I made was a washing basket, uh, which had a, a paint pot and a Dyson cylinder on top of, uh, with a, bits of belt and uh, <clears throat> some bits and pieces that I'd found around the house. Um, so yeah, and my first uh, David Tennant jacket was actually um, a woman's jacket which I'd found in a charity shop, uh, which I had for years, and my nan tried and tried and tried to get it thrown out, and eventually I, I did once so I got a sort of reasonable suit. Um, right, so next question. Um, Joshua um, asks, what's one of the most... Uh, What's one of the props you're, I'm most proud of? Um, <clears throat> well, this sort of links into um, Bex's question, which is about um, who is the individual that helped me build my TARDIS. Um, so, I mean, my, my TARDIS is just amazing. Um, and I built that five years ago uh, with my key worker at the children's home I was living at, Trevor. Um, and, yeah, it was, it was amazing um, to... to, to sort of sit there and do that um, you know it's, she's she's still standing um, although she has been a bit damaged over the years um, and had to sort of do repairs and what have you uh, but that's what happens when you have an outside TARDIS uh, um, I mean I'm looking at my um, shelf of props at the moment um, sort of my small ones um, I don't know there's, you know, there's, there's props that I, um, you know, I've enjoyed making. There's props that have been really tricky, uh, like the ramshackle device. That was one that was quite tricky to make. Um, and I mean, the the, uh, the, the, the adipose set. That was actually quite tricky to try and get some of the components for, um, get it right. Uh, that took four or five attempts to actually put that together, even though it's a quite a simple prop. Um, so yeah, uh, that's probably yeah probably my uh, my ramshackle device, especially as David Tennant's helped that. Um, so I'm quite quite proud of that. Um, so yeah, <laughs> hope that answers that question. Um, Anna Marie, uh, she asked me, what's the function of a rubber duck? Um, now this one goes in the bath. Um, got him at uh, Porthcrawl in Wales. Two pee machines, um, and the function of a rubber duck. Um, the longer ones, I think, that make a noise as well. They're dog toys, I think. Um, yeah. Um, <clears throat> and the last question is from James Sutton, who asks, "Will I marry him?" James, I'm sorry, I won't marry you. I don't think your girlfriend would appreciate that, and I don't swing that way. So yeah, uh, that's been the question and answer session for today, guys. Not many questions, but you know, it's, you know hopefully that will pick up in the comments. Um, yeah, so if you want to see another one of these um, and you've got some questions, do put them in the comments below. Uh, that'd be great. Um, so yeah, uh, hopefully some more prop tutorials will come soon, um, depending on when I get some more props made. Um, you know, it's having the time and being at work, it's a little bit tricky uh, to do that uh, with having the time. 
Um, but I have got the, 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 the tools, we have the technology, we can build it, as they say. Um, I've been working on the console quite a bit lately um, and sort of trying to sort that out because um, actually there's some structural bits on that which are a little bit... <sighs> go away! Um, <clears throat> Yeah, they need, to, they need sorting on that. Um, I think there's a few sort of props that I'm going to sort of tweak a little bit, uh, like the two discs and things like that, that uh, could do with a little bit of finishing and uh, making bits a little bit better on them. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, if you've got any questions, as I say, put them in the comments, and I'll hopefully do another question and answer video sometime soon and again suggest any props you'd like to see uh, you know even if it means I've got to sit there and make it um, if I've got the time I will um, so yeah cheers for watching guys and see you in the next one